Hey guys, Havasu Lou out in beautiful Lake Havasu. Hey, we're out here checking out a pretty unique property that was just listed, RV garage pool home in the residential estates area. Hang out, check it out too, and I'll talk to you in a minute. All right guys, this is 2241 Green Drive. It was just listed this morning, 1.795. Sits on a huge, almost 15,000 square foot lot in the residential estates area. So you have a full paver drive side and entry. A little bit of space over here. I call this the house of amenities and I'll show you why here in a minute. So this house does have natural gas and underground utilities. And so I'm just gonna try to point out as many things as I can while I'm doing this video without turning it into a small mini series on YouTube. So there is a high pressure street pressure hose bib installed right below the pressure regulator. So you get street pressure so you can wash off your garage uh, and your patio here. So they have very meticulous landscaping front and back. There's also extensive uh, use of outdoor uh, Malibu lights, LED lights, landscaping on the walls. Even the mailbox has a LED. It's a really nice front entry. Double arched wrought iron eight foot entry doors. All right guys, this is a four bedroom, five bath pool home built in 2017. 3,561 square feet. Again, sits on a 14,767 square foot lot. This house is totally custom. They have not missed one thing. 18 foot entry. There's four inch baseboards, LED can lights everywhere. Big custom tile floors that are sealed. So they did the Level five, trowel down walls and ceilings, extra wide hallways. So you have this huge open living area, 18 feet high. You have this limestone and tiled stacked uh, 18 foot fireplace that's on gas. This home has a full automation system, integrated speakers, control pad in the living room, keypads in every bedroom, and of course, accessible from your smartphone or tablet on the app. So just so you guys know, everything you see here is available outside of escrow. There's even a beautiful advantage boat in the garage that's for sale as well get to that shortly so there's this cool little floating shelf back here everything in this house has the soft close uh, cabinets and doors so you have a real nice size dining area And of course, a big breakfast bar. So like I said, this house has everything you could possibly think of. All the upgrades, every box was checked. They did the exotic granite upgrade for the kitchen. 
There is three stainless sinks in this house, in this kitchen, so we would call this a real chef's kitchen. So you have this cool under counter beverage fridge. It has dual doors. You also have an under counter ice maker. All the cabinets are upgraded, all soft close, under cabinet lighting. They did the GE monogram stainless appliance package and a huge oversized kitchen island. So I want to tell you guys real quick why I call this the house of amenities because there is two pages of upgrades and amenities for this house. And I'm going to try to get through as many as I can. Uh, but as you can see, there's quite a bit. So ask me for the list. It's in a PDF format I can send to you. So you have this really cool speed cook microwave oven, French door electric oven show you how that works real quick it's pretty cool and just so you guys know most of the stuff is like in new condition very seldom used it's got a six burner dual fuel gas range And there are two RO systems in this house, and the one that serves the sink here also serves hot water, which is pretty unique. So you have under counter trash. You have some pull outs. You also have a wine fridge. And you also have under counter storage also has pull out shelving soft clothes as well of course the home also has a full-blown security system and control for home automation system of course and you can basically control everything in the home so you have the dishwasher and the, basically the main stainless sink. Great views out to the backyard pool area that we're gonna go check out here in a minute. All right, guys, it's a killer kitchen. Let's go check out the rest of the house. So this house is four bedrooms and all four of them are basically master suites and there's five bed bathrooms so this would be bathroom number five and they did stack stone all the way to the ceiling really cool it's my favorite bathroom in the house they also did the uh, backlit and lighted mirrors in the whole house bathrooms so of course this is a split floor plan so you have your indoor laundry and access to the garage, which we'll go check out in a minute. And then you have your master. Again, you'll notice that the hallways are very wide compared to some stuff that we've seen. All the interior doors are solid core, eight foot four hinge doors. This is the master, the main master. It's got recessed lighting, coffered ceilings, can lights. Everything's been upgraded, of course. So there are three air conditioner systems in this home and there is a dedicated four ton central air just for this master suite and the casita. So you have window flank double French doors out to the backyard pool area. And you have your master suite, your main master suite with a jetted tub, dual vanities, all upgraded granite, huge lit mirror, can lights. There's also a huge glass door walk-in shower. 
has two heads, one being a rain head, tile, floor to ceiling, real nice stonework. So you have your water closet with its own door and it's super fancy. And of course your walk-in closet with some built-ins. All right, let's go check out the other side of the house. Of course you have a little linen closet. And I should mention there is a pocket door to this bathroom. And of course there's integrated speakers in here as well. All right, we're heading back down towards the entry to where the other two master suites are. There are down lights in all the hallways, so it lights up at night. Let's just check this one out first. It's just kind of at the center of the house here. Coffered ceilings in here as well. Of course you have speakers. Your double glass door closet. So you have a pocket door to this bathroom as well. Little junior master suite, backlit or lit mirror. Upgraded granite tops. And of course your glass door, walk-in shower, floor to ceiling tile. You have your dual flush toilets. So you have the third master suite at the front of the house. And so there is a five ton central AC that just serves the main house. Again, the master and the casita share a four ton unit. And of course the garage has its own unit. We'll get to that shortly. Coffered ceilings in here as well. Sound, can lights of course. Again, this whole place can come furnished. So basically what you see can be what you get. They did the upgraded uh, Venetian blinds throughout the entire house. So you have your other junior master suite, same kind of setup, pocket door, lit mirror, upgraded granite tops, your high efficiency dual flush toilet, and your glass door walk-in shower with the floor to ceiling tile. All right, let's go check out the casita, the pool and the garage. So there's an indoor laundry and the washer and dryer come with the house no matter what. There is a pocket door in here, solid surface counters and your Ingress, egress door out to the garage, can lights. Let me show you this. These are like super high capacity wash and dryer. It, they haven't even really been used, but check this out. So the washer has this cool pedestal washer for small loads. Very cool. This thing is like brand new. Don't show your wives or you'll end up buying one. It's also a stainless sink. All right, let's go check out the garage. So they spared no expense with this garage setup. Has a three car garage with an RV garage. Usually you only see the two car plus RV. This one has actually a three car garage with 30 and 35 foot bays, eight foot doors. All doors are insulated. They even have roll up door contacts for the security system. This is where you have dual uh, tankless water heaters, your RO system. And again, there's two RO systems in this house. One of them serves hot water, your water softener, and one of the tanks. There are two stainless sinks in here. 
built-in cabinets, soft touch clothes on these, beer fridge stays, and these epoxy floors are something to see. I'll tell you what, they are called custom lava flow metallic epoxy floors. They look like they're 3D and they look like they'll suck you in and they're still wet. If you ever wanted to eat off a garage floor, this would be the one to do it. So by the way, the Advantage is also for sale. Reach out to me and I'll give you the details. So they did the uh, LED panel lights in here everywhere. There's also sound, ceiling fans, cameras, and of course your 62 and a half foot RV garage bay with a 14 foot door. They also put in a cool French drain that spans all the way across and drains outside so you can wash your car or your boat or your RV with this soft water hose bib right here. And as you can see, there is also full hookups with a 50 amp. Of course, don't forget about the TV that's on a swing out arm. So you can watch some games while you're out here working in the garage as there is a dedicated five ton central AC in this garage, not many splits. It's got its own central air heat pump. So it'll also call for heat as well. So something I like to point out that you might not need, but if you notice there's three panel lights above the, the boat there, that is something they did so that when these uh, dual hatches are open, they have light over each engine compartment. This is one of the cleanest Advantage boats I've ever seen. It's like brand new. I'm gonna guess why it looks so good. Got some products up here, huh? So there's another stainless sink out here and then there's a rear man door that goes into the casita and we're just going to go through here right now and check it out all right so you have this cool little casita out here it's about 12 by 12 nothing huge but it'd make a real cool uh, pool house or even a office which is what they have set it up as with a huge window so you have a nice view of the pool area eight foot entry door there, can lights of course. That's a sleeper bed. So this has a bathroom as well. Got your dual flush toilet and another walk-in glass door shower. Same setup, tile from floor to ceiling. Almost forgot there's a lit mirror in here as well. So there is a closet in here and this is where the automation server rack lives. There are three hardwired Wi-Fi access points in this home, including the garage and the back patio. They also put in a dedicated ceiling fan, so it keeps it cool. All very neatly wired, no hodgepodge. All right, so we're going out the casita door to the backyard, huge, huge covered back patio, travertine decking and coping throughout the whole backyard pool setup. So it has this cool party size travertine margarita table. It also has jets in the back of it, around it. So when you're sitting there, you can turn on the jets. Full custom pool, it's 10 feet deep. So it stays cool in the summer. And as you can see, there's also some fire features. Full blown 1000 PSI commercial grade misting system covers the entire patio. Everything can be controlled from your phone, fully automated has two panels. There's also speakers out here in the back as well as under roof 
And there's, of course, LED lights everywhere in this house. And you have some really cool dual uh, water, fire features. One of my favorite parts of the house at night. It's amazing. You guys should check out the pictures in the MLS. They're amazing. You have a huge oversized spa with a control at the spa. Travertine decking. There's down lights around the whole thing that are LED. Nice tile. So they are meticulous about their landscaping. So the gardener is here all the time, making sure everything's right. There's also LED lights underneath this uh, travertine coping on top of the stack stone here. And you have a real big uh, travertine coped uh, natural gas fire pit. Also has some stack stone. And a huge sit at bar and grill. A little better than Havasu Lou's bar and grill, of course. You have a little bit of side access over here and they even put lights down here as well. There's also full drains on this house and they all drain into underground plumbing that go out to the street. Forgot to mention there's also dual tankless water heaters in this house. Told you there's a lot of stuff to get to here. Nice little seating area. So you have a commercial gas heater for the patio and of course your TV setup. So the bar is really, really nice. Has a sink. This is a ice chest type setup. So you can keep ice in here and it'll drain out. So you have a real nice barbecue setup with a vented hood, all natural gas. Everything here is on natural gas, including the three AC heat pumps. Got a little drawer, stainless sink. And I wanted to show you guys this cool fan. It looks like a missile coming out of the sky left it off because when it's spinning you can't really tell so i told you there was a lot to get to hope you guys are still watching hope you enjoyed it got a couple seats around the back of this margarita table as well pool is huge beautiful so there are the thousand psi plus commercial misters I know, finally you guys are seeing somebody else's mister backyard besides mine. So it has misters all the way around. They have articulating heads on these, which is pretty cool. And also has a throw valve right up there to kill the bar section if you don't want it going on the bar. I have these and they are probably one of the best things I did for my backyard. They don't really show well on video for whatever reason, but definitely makes a big, big difference. I'm ready for summer, I don't know about you. So this is one of my favorite features are these electric retractable awnings they do not have a wind sensor like you would have like on a high-end RV, but they are on a remote and they come out pretty quick and there's three of them. Very cool feature. Just like that, you're in the shade.
All right, guys, have a see Lou back again with you. I hope you enjoyed the video walkthrough of the house over here on 2241 Green Drive. I know this one was a little bit longer than usual. Like I told you, there is just a lot of amenities and that is why I call it the house of amenities. So I will put a direct link to the listing detail page right below this video so you guys get all the original listing pictures, current price and uh, availability. Of course, you do wanna get in there and check out the night pictures, they're amazing. Uh, this house, of course, was just listed this morning for 1.795. If you guys have any questions or there's anything you think I missed, always feel free to reach out to me. All my contact information is right below this video as well. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.